Hi everyone, today we're diving into the world of blockchain. It sounds complicated, but don't worry, it's all about to make sense. Imagine a digital notebook. This isn't just any notebook though. This notebook is shared with everyone. It records transactions, agreements, and all sorts of important information. This shared secure record is what we call a blockchain. The best part? It's super safe, like a vault with a combination that everyone knows. But no one can change the combination once it's set. We'll learn more about how it stays secure later on. For now, just remember, blockchain is all about trust and transparency. Pretty cool, right? Believe it or not, the idea of blockchain has been around longer than you might think. Back in 1991, two brilliant scientists, Stuart Haber and W. Scott Stornetta, laid the groundwork. Our goal was to create a system where timestamps on digital documents couldn't be tampered with. We use cryptography, which is like secret code language for computers. Their work was like planting a seed. It took a while to grow, but eventually it blossomed into the blockchain technology we know today. It wasn't until 2008 that blockchain took a giant leap forward. Remember that name, 2008. That's when an anonymous person or group using the name Satoshi Nakamoto created Bitcoin. Bitcoin used blockchain technology to become the first decentralized digital currency. Decentralized? We'll explain that in a bit. Decentralization is one of the coolest things about blockchain. In a centralized system, think banks or governments. There's one central authority in charge, like the librarian who keeps track of all the books. But with blockchain, there's no single point of control. It's like having a library where everyone has a copy of the book catalog. Everyone shares the responsibility of keeping the records accurate and up to date. This makes it incredibly difficult for anyone to cheat the system or change the records without others noticing. Think of it like a giant global spreadsheet that everyone can see and trust. No more middlemen, no more single points of failure. Pretty empowering, right? Section four, the blockchain breakdown, how it all works. Okay, let's break down how blockchain actually works. Imagine a blockchain as a chain of blocks. Makes sense, right? Each block is like a container filled with information about transactions. First, a transaction is requested. Let's say you want to send some cryptocurrency to a friend. Your request is broadcast to the network of computers. These computers, called nodes, check to make sure you have enough cryptocurrency to send. They're like the fact checkers of the system. Once verified, your transaction is grouped together with other verified transactions into a block. Each block gets a unique fingerprint called a hash. It's like a digital signature. If any information in the block changes, the hash changes too. The new block is linked to the previous block in the chain, creating a permanent and unbreakable record. And voila, that's the basic idea of how blockchain works. Section 5, Cryptography, Keeping Things Secure. Now let's talk about cryptography. It's the secret sauce that makes blockchain so secure. Cryptography uses complex mathematical algorithms to protect information, kind of like having a super-powered lock and key system. One important method is called hashing. Remember those unique block fingerprints? That's hashing in action. Another key method is public key cryptography. It's like having two keys, a public key that everyone knows and a private key that only you know. You can use your public key to receive cryptocurrency and your private key to authorize transactions. It's like having a digital signature that proves it's really you. Section six, beyond Bitcoin, blockchain's bright future. Blockchain technology is about so much more than just cryptocurrency. It has the potential to revolutionize all sorts of industries. Imagine secure and transparent supply chains where you can track your food from farm to table. Or digital voting systems that are virtually impossible to rig. Blockchain can also help us verify digital identities, manage medical records securely, and even create new forms of digital art and collectibles. The possibilities are truly endless. As we continue to explore the potential of blockchain, one thing's for sure, it's going to be an exciting ride. Keep on exploring, everyone!